Hello everybody, Choristics here today. We are continuing on part two, and apparently I'm supposed to find something within 72 hours. So I need to find something. I saw a guy running up here. That dude. Hey, 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 come back. Really? <laughs> Fine. I have no idea what I'm doing. Why am I constantly running left? One second, let me fix this problem. I have fixed the problem. I hope. So, a stupid thing on my computer is that I can't press more than three buttons at a time, otherwise it'll glitch out and do something. Wait, wait, hang on. This is my private property. Don't try using it when I'm not around. I've already sold out my ways, and the carnival hasn't even begun. I'm thinking of closing up shop so I can buy a gift for my wife and return to her in my village. I've heard that a stone called Moon's Tear shines brighter than any other in the land. If you've got one, I would really like it to get it from you. My wife, my, 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 my wife, blah. If you give it to me, I'll give you my spot here, deck of flower included. Okay, so apparently you you know what? Oh, okay, never mind, he's gonna growl at me. West Clock Town. Courtesy shop. I go inside this door. Hey, dude. God, I don't want you. Junk, anyways. Bomb shop. Uh, I don't need to be in here. I'm guessing I can't buy a bomb yet, anyways, so what's the point? Hey there, little guy. Won't you deposit some rupees? Nowadays, even if people have money, they don't deposit any. Nothing, nothing. For a limited time, I'll give you a special gift based on how much you deposit. For example, if you deposit 200 rupees, you'll get an item that holds a lot of rupees. Well, if you change your mind, come back and make a deposit. What's with you? You're wearing that weird hat for a Deku. Did you come? To town to play, I bet nobody will play with you, right? The adults here are all busy getting ready for the carnival. The old astronomer at the observatory outside town is the only one who will spend any time playing with us kids. We bombers have our hideout at the observatory. You have the secret. Take a secret. Oh, don't be telling Jim. Oh, okay. Whatever. Shut up. Let's get out of here. The secret route to the observatory? How do you know about that? Only Jim and us are supposed to know the secret route. Fine. 
Oh, what's in here? Lottery. Sure. Okay, I'll come back later. So it's right now, 11 o'clock. Stop, stop. Okay. I am no child. Did you not see my swirly hat dance? That takes true skill. Oh, wait, what? Can I go in there? Yes! Have fun sleeping. Oh. Let me out. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. Where am I now? Okay. Uh, let me try. Back here. There's a balloon. Oh my god. Right there. That's Tingle. What's this? Green clothes, white fairy? Oh my! My name is Tingle. I am the same as you, sir. A forest fairy. Alas, I though am already at the age of 35, no fairy has come to me yet. My father tells me to grow up and act my age, but why? I tell you, Tingle is very reincarnation of a fairy. Now, while I stand here waiting for my fairy to on my own, I show maps to help out my father. Lucky, lucky, you're so lucky to have a fairy. I know, I know, we should be friends. Yes, yes, in exchange, I will sell you a map for cheap as a sign of my friendship. Yippee! <laughs> well, call again. Tangle, tangle, kalula pa! I already did. Oh yeah. I want to. Well then. Up the slide I go now. Over. Oh god, down. I will run over here now. I really want to fall. I don't know. I don't know where I'm going. Fine. I'll go this way. He's juggling. This episode is going to be called Exploration. If you want to pass through here, you gotta say the secret code. Wrong! Jim said I can't let anyone pass if they don't know the secret code. If you're not a member, they won't teach you the secret code. If you want to be a member, go see Jim in North Block Town. <sighs> People are so needy. I'll go to North Clock Town in a second. Hello, ma'am. 
Welcome. Do you have some business? The room on the left is the mayor's room. It sounds like they're having some kind of meeting. I think. The room on your right is the drawing room, and it's also Madame Rona's room. Office. Balls. Most of the townsfolk already have taken shelter without waiting for the mayor's orders. The only ones left are public servants and the committee members. Mr. Mayor and the Carnival Committee members, please order those who remain to evacuate. Err. Uh, uh, well. You cowards, do you actually believe the moon will fall? The confused townsfolk simply caused a panic by believing this ridiculous ground story. The soldiers couldn't prevent the panic, but outside the town walls is where the danger is. You want answers? The answer is that the carnival should not be cancelled. There's no way to survive. Uh, mm, well... Huh? Are you serious, Moto? It seems a giant chunk of rock above us hasn't caught your eye. At this time every year, we are going to be overrun by tourists. So why is the town empty? Clearly, it's your job to enjoy the carnival's operation, but that... But that's if people are here for it. Don't drag the merchants and soldiers into this. If the soldiers rest the run, then run, listen. We councilmen will stick to tradition. This carnival will be a success. I've never heard of a defense unit abandoning its town. Madame Mara, when Charlie saw the same thing when she mayored Dutor. Let's not bring my wife into this. Huh? Ah. Almost take refuge. Honor of the carnival. Okay. Um, my guess is that I go talk to this lady. Oh dear, are you a student of Deku Elementary? Where is your teacher? You shouldn't be here. Fear trips go next door. Then you'll teach a lot. Are you fans damp lately? Oh, that's the greeting of use among us, Zora. Where's your mama, Shadow? Ah, you came here by yourself? But well, aren't you a big boy? Ooh, door. Hello? Deku, boy. Tile, talk to me. I don't. Well, it says first, so that's, I'm guessing it's first. She looks so. Ugh. Whatever. Okay, so I need to go to North Town. North clock down. The only open way that I see is over here. First day, 60 hours remain. How about it? Will the young man play? Sure. If the time it takes you to get all the rubies is fast, 
Scroll down another one, so the best time of today is 1.15. Kelvin, you'll be faster than that. No, no! What are we doing? Fine. Screw you over in the tongue biscuit here. Ah, God, that was horrible. Okay, I'm in North Clock Town. And I know where I'm going straight for. I'm going straight for that plant. A heart container? Hey, what's this guy doing? I'm not doing anything suspicious, really. Yes, you are. Oh my god, how am I so stupid? Can I? How do you... Oh, let me check it. Can I get past, please? I'm confused. Alright, well, I think that's a good stopping point for the second episode because I've done a lot of exploring and it's like the second day. Okay, well, I'm going to stop it here. As I just said, uh, why am I saying it again? I don't know. Stop asking me these questions. Anyways, uh, yeah, this series was asked by New Ratio, close friend of mine on YouTube and in real life, blah blah stuff. So, I'll put a link in the description below so you can check out our channel. Good stuff. Alright, well, I will talk to your people later. Goodbye and stuff. Goodbye.